हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल माय सेल्फ पराग जांबुलकर अप टिल नाउ वी हैव सीन इंसर्ट अपडेट एंड डिलीट डीएमएल ऑपरेशन राइट इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी अनडिलीट ऑपरेशन अनडिलीट मीन रिस्टोरिंग रिकॉर्ड्स व्हिच वी हैव डिलीटेड नाउ सी सो हियर आई हैव ओपन दिस ऑब्जेक्ट कॉलेज अंडरस्कोर अंडरस्कोर सी एंड दीज आर द रिकॉर्ड्स इन दिस ऑब्जेक्ट नाउ व्हाट वी विल डू वी विल डिलीट दिस रिकॉर्ड्स व्हिच स्टार्ट्स विद डब्ल्यू सी so like this this wc123 wc123 and wc this record so we will delete all these wc records and after that we will undelete it means we will restore the, these records from the recycle bin now see i am opening anonymous window now see so what we will do so see in last video we have seen how to delete any records right so what we will do first we will delete records which has college name wc which starts with wc so see and after that we will restore it okay so here we have to write query which fetch records which starts with the wc right now see here we have written query which return record with name wc but what we want we want all the records where records start with wc so what we can write here we will change our query like and wc percent why we are writing like this because see we have records wc1 wc2 wc3 right so all the records where name is like this which starts with wc so we'll delete all those records and after that we'll restore it from the recycle bin okay so we'll execute this query okay so we didn't get any error now we will check see so previously these were the records of college object right now see we will refresh grid we will click on this button refresh grid so after clicking here here you can see all the records with college name wc or which starts with wc are deleted now we will check recycle bin whether these records are there in recycle bin or not okay so we will move to lightning experience here nine dots are there we will click on this here we will type recycle bin so here you can see all the records which we have deleted okay so records which has college name which starts with wc or which has college name wc like this so all records are deleted right so total these are 10 records right and uh, those records which are not deleted those are three so three plus third uh, 10 total are 13 records right so these records are now in recycle bin so what we will do we will undelete these records we will take these records back to our object now see how we can do it so again we will open anonymous window now see i am commenting these lines and we will undelete it so see how to undelete so again same thing i am creating one list variable of type this object api name here we have to write query now see this is same query right previously what we have seen it is the same query like this we are fetching records from the this object right now see some extra thing we have added so we will go one by one i will explain now what is the meaning of this see by this we are fetching records from the college object right and one thing we have added here all rows now what is the meaning of all rows when we are mentioning this keyword all space rows it will return all the records which are deleted and non deleted that means records which are present in object and records which are present in recycle bin all the records which are deleted and non deleted not deleted so all these records will be fetched by this query when we mention keyword all rows right but see we are not interested in records those are in object we are interested in records which are deleted so how we can get those records so for that purpose we have to add one condition like this so see here we have added this thing where is deleted is equal to true now what is the meaning of this see selfos what it does when records are deleted so for those records it is adding one field 
and that field name is is deleted it is a boolean field so when it is true that means that record is deleted right so when we are adding this condition where is deleted is equal to true see here we are not mentioning in single quote here we are not mentioning like this not in single quote because it is boolean value right when we are mentioning in single quote means that is a text a string but true we are not mentioning as a string we are mentioning as a value boolean value like this so now see what is the meaning of this query now we are fetching records from this object college underscore underscore c where is it deleted is equal to true that means that records are deleted and all rows means it fetch all deleted and non deleted records and from all deleted and non deleted records we want only those records which are deleted right so in short we are getting all the deleted records right in this list we are getting all the deleted records now see what we can do we can call this keyword undelete deleted records and one more thing we can do we can use database dot undelete see we can use this so see here we can mention this variable undeleted records and here we can pass value false and what is the meaning of this so we have two options see so we can use keyword undelete and by this we can delete what are the records that we have mentioned in this variable but when we are using this keyword undelete so at that time partial success is not allowed that means either all the records will get restored or zero records are restored means partial success is not allowed but if you want partial success should get allowed in that case we have to mention we have to use database class we are using this method undelete this is a list variable right and along with list variable we are passing parameter false and by this partial success is allowed so already we have seen for update insert delete at that time we have used the class database right now see so what we will do only one operation we will use okay so now we will use keyword undelete and we will check whether those records are restored into our object or not now see i am clicking on execute button okay so we didn't get any error now see so uh, previously there were three records right because the remaining records are deleted and those were in recycle bin that already we have seen now see we will refresh this grid okay so i am clicking on this button refresh grid let us see so see by clicking on this we got all the records right all the deleted records wc1 wc2 so those records in recycle bin and those records are restored those records are undeleted and those records have come back to our object so previously uh, there were three records now it is 13 because 10 records were deleted and we uh, took them to back to our object right again uh, what we'll do we'll check in recycle bin see these are the 10 records previously those were in recycle bin right so we'll refresh it let us see okay so see recycle bin is empty there are no records in recycle bin because all records we have restored into our object and see uh, we here also we have option by this also we can restore but we have restored these records by using our apex program right okay so in this way we can write code to delete and undelete so friends i hope you like this video if yes then click on like subscribe to the channel and don't forget to press bell icon so that you will get notification of my next video so stay connected thank you